before making any modification to the CAX files. We strongly recommend the backup of all your data. Firstly, the installation of the hardware will be carried out. Find the PCIe power cables for the GPU card. Install the GPU card in the open type PCIe by A slot next to the Thunderbolt board and then screw tightly the GPU card in the chassis. Plug the PCIe power cables onto the GPU card according to each GPU card's power requirement. Right after the hardware installation, software configuration will be proceeded. The following procedures must be done on Mac. OS X Yosemite is taken as the example. Step 1. Open terminal. Enter the command to enable Yosemite to use the modified web driver. We can copy and paste the command from the PDF to speed up similar procedures. Before proceeding to step 2, the text editing software needs to be downloaded and installed. Please visit Barebones website to download the software. There are three files that need to be modified. The first one is MVDS Startup. Select Go to Folder, enter the path, find the info placed file, and modify it with Text Wrangler. After modifying the content, the file needs to be saved. The second file that needs to be modified is IONDRB support. To copy and paste the path from the PDF to look for and modify the file. Save the file. The third file that needs to be modified is Apple HDA controller. Remember to save the file. Step 3. Download from the NVIDIA website and install the latest Mac CUDA driver.
Step 4. Install the modified web driver. After installing the modified web driver, the content of one file will be changed. So we need to modify the file MVDA startup again. Step 6. Open terminal and enter the command to clear the cache. After clearing the catch, shut down the Mac. Connect Mac and Thunderbolt PCIe expansion chassis by Thunderbolt cable. After powering on, Mac will work properly with the GPU card. 